Hello, I'm Jen Liang Shabu with Shures Pro Systems Group. This video will take you through how to set manual IP addresses for Shures Microflex Wireless or MXW system. Before starting, make sure you have Adobe Flash installed on your computer, as well as the Shure Web Discovery application. This application is included on the USB thumb drive with the MXW access point or is available as a free download from the Shure website. Connect all MXW components together with shielded CAT5e or CAT6 cable and connect your computer to the same network. Make sure your computer is set to obtain an IP address automatically on a PC or using DHCP if you're on a Mac. If no DHCP server is present, your computer and the MXW devices will fall back to a link local address. Launch the Sure Web Discovery application. Any Sure device with an embedded graphical user interface will appear in this window, along with its current IP address. If you have version 1.0.12 or later, network chargers with firmware version 2 or later will also appear on this list, though there is no GUI associated with them. Double-click on the MXW APT. The default password is admin. Enter it now and click Log On. When the GUI has finished loading, click on the Utility tab. The name, IP address, and firmware version of all devices are shown in this view. Clicking on the Edit button under each device properties will allow you to set the desired IP address settings for each device. It does not matter in what order you set the IP addresses because the changes will not take effect until you click the Apply All button next to Pending Changes. In this example, let's start with the MXW APT by clicking the Edit button. Note that the MXW APT requires two IP addresses, one for control and one for networked audio. Click the drop-down menu for IP mode under Control and select Manual. Enter the desired IP address, subnet mask, and if required, gateway. Repeat for networked audio. Note that you can also modify the name of the device if so desired. Click Add Updates. Note that the Edit button has turned yellow and now says Pending. No IP addresses have actually changed yet. The Apply All button is also flashing yellow. Repeat this procedure until all devices have been assigned the desired IP addresses. When you are finished, click the Apply All button. A confirmation screen will appear to verify you wish to proceed. If so, click Yes. Since your MXW devices are now likely set to IP addresses in a different range than your computer, you will need to set your computer to a static IP address in the same subnet. Once this is done, go back to the Web Discovery application, double-click the APT, and enter the admin password. Go to the Utility page to confirm that all devices now have the appropriate IP addresses. 